as you and I are speaking right now, your German Chancellor Olaf Scholz is uh, literally on his way. Uh, it's going to be his first trip as Chancellor um, to meet with Xi Jinping. Uh, and he's also bringing a number of German CEOs with him. That's a very different message than some in the German government, like the foreign minister, would want him to deliver. It's also a very different message than you're hearing from the United States right now. Talk about what the German Chancellor is thinking when it comes to the China policy. I don't know what he's thinking. I can only tell you what, um, you know, my assessment of the situation. Number one, I believe it's important that um, a German chancellor talks to the Chinese president. Um, is um, now a few weeks after the um, party congress the right moment to do it? One can doubt it. Is it at a time where everybody in Germany, outside Germany, is warning Germany, you know, uh, from getting dependent again, you know, on, on one country like our dependency energy on Russia, dependency on trade, um, you know, on China? Is it the right signal to send a CEO group with a chancellor? You know, there are, um, I have doubts that this is the right, right thing to do at this stage. Um, also, I, I regret a bit that the Chancellor um, didn't take up the offer of the French President, uh, Macron, to go, together. to go together. I think that would have been a, a strong political statement, you know, we stand together, Germany, France, and we tell you, listen, um, you know, we are in favor of a rules-based international order and we want you also expect from China to also to support that. Uh, do you think that the uh, German government generally trusts that the French would be aligned on not just that message, but also cutting side deals uh, from an industrial policy perspective? I mean, there are a lot of German and French companies that are actually competing in terms of access to the Chinese. Yes, but you could, um, um, I mean, it happens differently anyway, but you can imagine a trip where you just talk politics and you don't talk about um, economic uh, measures or, or business um, opportunities. You know, just the, we are, you know, in, at a stage where um, you know, with the Russia invasion, we are in inflection point where, you know, a lot is at stake and to talk to somebody who um, um, is close to Russia, I think is important.